Hello and welcome back folks. Casio seems to be on a roll with their vintage releases and this year is no exception. But could the upcoming LF20 be their most anticipated release so far? Welcome to Wrist Action. The LF20W is to be released in Japan in May and will probably be released to the rest of the world sometime in June. It's a reimagining of the original AE20W twin graph, which was first released in 1985. The AE20W has a cult following amongst Casio enthusiasts, and good examples can fetch northwards of $300. Casio have taken the essence of the original's design and have updated it for the 21st century. Initially, it will be offered in three different colorways, slate grey, cream and black. Prices for the rest of the world haven't been announced, but in Japan it's set to retail for 4,400 yen, which is the equivalent to $33. The dial of the LF20W is broken up into a few different sections. The bottom panel displays the full time broken up into hours, minutes and seconds. The larger top left area shows an analog representation of the current time, and the top right panel shows the analog representation of the seconds, and the final panel shows the date. Covering the dial will be a crystal made of mineral glass, and the plastic push buttons on the original AE20W have been changed for metal push buttons on the LF20W. The watch is designed to be unisex, so it measures a bit smaller than other square Casios, such as the AE1200. The dimensions are only 33.7mm in width, 37.8mm in length and is also quite thin at only 8.6mm. As for the weight, it's also going to be fairly light, weighing in at only 23 grams. Materials used for the case and band is resin and this is said to be made from biomass plastic. This is manufactured from environmentally friendly biomass sources such as vegetable fats and oils. As for the features of the watch, it's going to come with a stopwatch, alarm, multi-time for different cities, and also an auto calendar. They've also added, thankfully, an amber LED backlight, which the original didn't come with. Power for the watch is going to come from a single CR1616 battery, which will last approximately 3 years, and the water resistance is rated at 30 meters. That's all the information I have so far for the upcoming Casio LF20W and I'll give you a full review when it comes out. Would you get one and if so, in which colour? Thanks for watching folks and I'll catch you next time.